It's the thrill ride that ended in disaster. These seats were filled with children and spinning at speed when the ride suddenly stopped. Of course, when it stops, the swings went all different directions with the children on it and um, they were bouncing off the uh, steel frames. The fall so severe, some witnesses claim the children were hurled out of their seats. Everything came to a complete halt. Kids were falling out of it. People ran in trying to get some kids out. There was uh, two kids on the floor. I heard this crash of all this metal and all these seats and clicking together. And then I looked to my left and I saw the swing ride. It collapsed. All these people were there. I actually saw someone fall out of the cart. Emergency crews were on the scene quickly, treating children in front of worried parents. Many were taken to hospital, but incredibly, most injuries were relatively minor. I happen to be a trauma surgeon in town, so I assessed the area and assessed all the kids at the time, and no one seemed greatly injured. All the kids were moving their extremities and everything. Connecticut State Police are now investigating what went wrong with the Zuma ride at the Norwalk Oyster Festival. Well, all of those injured are expected to make a full recovery. Toby Sadler, Sky News.